you. Why when people see a little, 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 little space, knowing it's two cars sitting in, and if they pull in, they're going to have a hard time tapping the other car's door because they're that close. And this is the second time I've seen it. So, my question is, all this space around, why squeeze in that little space? Well, you got to squeeze out I was at Staples on Sunday, and this gentleman squeezed in the spot between me and another car. He was so squished that he was trying to leave. Look at this. Look at this. Just look at this. You see this? This car is literally about to freaking squeeze in his little spot. Look. Look at the spot. Look, look at the spot, look at this. They are literally about to squeeze in this little spot. I'm just literally watching them. Do you see this? Do you see this? He's inching back. People are freaking crazy. Now, as they're getting out, they're that close to the doors. I don't understand. That is like, I think when builders see space, when they see space, they have to inch in it. So if someone's door home uh, they'll spend a million dollars on a home and all they could do is they could take their arms and stretch it out like this and touch wall to wall and they'll be happy so now they're parked in this space their whole front is out i don't understand people why i don't understand the parking mechanism is crazy in new york these people are crazy some of them can't drive. I don't mean no harm, but at a certain age, you need to retire driving. It's for your own safety, too, as well as the pedestrians and the other drivers. I don't think that people in their late 80s and 90s should be driving. And if you are in a, a, a great place with good health and vision, I think it's okay. But when you're slouched all the way down and you're hunched back and you're driving like you're a snail, you should not be driving. People check on your parents and your grandparents and your great-grandparents and your great-great-great-grandparents. Check on them because they're still driving. And some of them can't even see over the front of the truck or car and they be in some bad cars so I think they take their retirement money and buy a car because someone wanted them to buy that car but let them drive it every now and then so they feel like it's theirs people check on your parents your grandparents your great great grandparents your great 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 grandparents check on them because a lot of times the roads ain't right.